again, and today I think I should do a little confession about the, the gaming series of this character right here, Sonic. And I have to say is that I think that that the classic series are really great and all, and the adventure series is also pretty much rad. But there's one thing I have to confess about Sonic the Hedgehog series. I think that 2006 through 2009 were possibly the worst years of Sonic the Hedgehog. It's all because it started off with one game, Sonic 06. <laughs> Man, that game was really bad. And then after that, there was Sonic in the Secret Rings. <laughs> no, that's another bad game because uh, the the controls are pretty much bleh and has a pretty much a mediocre storyline. Uh, Sonic Rush Adventure was is pretty good. And then there was also more of the Sonic Rider series. God, I hate the Sonic Rider series. I, f I also free pretty much hate the Babylon Rogues. They're possibly the worst characters in the series in my opinion. And then there was Sonic Unleashed which was half good and half bad. In which um uh, the half the the half that was bad would have to be the werehog. <laughs> Got stupid stretchy legs, ultimate furry action. <laughs> what the Sega must be smoking a lot of crack right there. And it only got better. Pretty much, it rec Sonic recovered at a uh, Sonic Gen uh, Colors, which was. It's a pretty really good game. They they took the good half of what made Sonic un the good half of Sonic Unleashed and and they improved on it. We got no Werehog. Thank goodness, I hate the Werehog. And then also uh I also have to confess to another thing. Out of Mario and Sonic series, I think this character has the best series in all of them. Yeah, Mega Man has a series both superior to Mario and Sonic. Set. Mega Man has always been pushing out gold more than Mario and Sonic. Well, that's my opinion on the Sonic series.